I'm Jimi Hendrix, and this episode is called Stretch Your Time Management on Empower Your Pattern 2.0. I'm Jimi Hendrix, member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints and Success, Confidence, and Thrive Coach. I'm going to pattern to help us to see more, help us to live a better and extraordinary life. I will give you temporal and spiritual tips how to overcome these things in this life. So if you come with me, I will show you these patterns. Get ready, walk in. Let's go. Now, I am, I, I'm going to be honest with you, I feel inadequate to talk about this. So, Let's bring up, if we're going like, to bring up a theory, I like one that's used by Dr. Della Toro McNeil II. It's called Parkinson's Law. Okay, you're not going to believe this. It's Cyril Parkinson, who was a naval historian, he said this, the task will swell to meet the allotted time. Okay, say you say, well... I gotta make three sales calls. And I can make three sales calls in, say, two hours. Oh, no, no, no. Say in three days. Now, that's kind of silly. But say you, hey, hey, I gotta make these three sales calls in one solid hour. You know what? It's gonna take an hour. If you say it to take three days, it'll make three days. If you say it takes an hour, it makes an hour. But you have to learn to manage your time. And this is something I'm having to learn using the morning routine and, and the like. And so, because in, in many ways, and this goes along with the time what's mentioned in the Bible. Okay. How we need to be redeeming redeeming the time. And why is that? Colossians chapter four. Verse 2 talks about walk in wisdom toward them that are without, redeeming the time. But there's some edits. Um, Ephesians chapter 5 verse 16. Redeeming the time because the days are evil. Well, how do you redeem your time? You manage it. You stretch yourself to, to meet the time constraints that you give yourself. Say, okay, t- tomorrow. And this is one I'm sitting up for myself. I'm going to put it on, 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 on notion. 4 a.m. 4 p.m. tomorrow. Regardless, I got four sales calls to make. And by, by tomorrow, by the end of the four o'clock hour, non-negotiable. Okay, so you see, you stretch your time. You stretch your time. And see, if you stretch your time, once you have a purpose and you stretch your time, you stretch your time, it makes all the difference in the world. It makes all the difference in the world. So, redeeming the time, what that means translates to me is intentional time management. Intentional time management. I don't know how many times that, that I have gone to therapy and my therapist has said, Jimmy, really untruthfully, you need to be a little bit more intentional. You, you need to be more intentional. And you know what? That's true. 
That's true, because <laughs> me, sometimes I kind of let things go crazy. And when things go crazy, they don't go, they don't go so good. You can sit there and say, I don't want to make those folks home cold. Let me ask you something. What's going to make motivate you to do that? What, what, what's going to motivate you to think that time constraint? What's going to motivate you to do How important is that to you? Listen to me. This isn't, this isn't something for you to just sit there and put in, I hope it works out. I hope it works out. I hope it works out. And you wonder why it's not working. I mean, come on. I'm, I'm in in a way I'm trying to be nice and prepare people. I'm talk I'm preaching as much to myself as I am to you guys. You know? I'm sitting here with a lemon water nursing you guys, talking to you guys how important time management is. Because I realize I got, I got to make some sales presentations. I got to decide the book stops here. So with that, I hope you enjoyed watching, listening to Empower Your Pattern 2.0. If you like what you hear, please subscribe. Become a part of Pattern Realm. This is Jimi Hendrix saying until next time, don't just sit there and take it. Build your dreams so you can take it. Do what others don't so you can be what others want. And do what others want so you can have it as camp. Please share this with Mama Son, Papa Son, and everyone. This is Jimi Hendrix Center. Next time, choose, act, and pursue happiness. And remember this from the bottom of my heart. Jimmy loves you. I really love you.